हरे कृष्णा माता जी
Secondly, uh, Sri Gurudev will be staying here through the end of the program. So in case in between he goes, he will come back. So please stay seated. It causes a lot of inconvenience for him. So please stay seated. He is going to be here through the end of the program. Okay? Hare Krishna. Thank <laughs> you. 
ओज गोपी नॉट सा नॉट नित्य सिद्धा गोपीज बट द गोपीज ऑफ दो कम इन द गोपी फॉर्म फ्रॉम जनकपुरी इन जनकपुरी वेन सीता वॉज मैरिड विथ राम देन ऑल द यंग लेडीज वॉन्टेड टू मैरी विथ राम राम टोल देन ओ यू शुड कम इन गोपी फॉर्म इन कृष्ण लीला देर आर वी फुलफिल यू लीला दैट जौथकी और जौथकी एंड सो मेनी काइंड ऑफ गोपीज दे वैर परफॉर्मिंग वर्सिटिंग कत्यायनी दैट कृष्ण शुड बी अवर मोस्ट विलव है माई हस्बैंड एंड सो फॉर ए वन दे वैर डूइंग एंड टू कृष्ण एंड कृष्ण टू फिलफुल देर डिजायर One day he came when they were taking bath naked, and Krishna took their all garments and climbed on the tree and began to laugh. When Gopi saw, where are my garments? Oh, they saw that Krishna has climbed on the tree and taking all these and with his small friends. Then they began to. Request Krishna. Krishna, give us our garment. Krishna said, "Oh, you have made something offence for Varun Dev. You are taking bath in morning naked. So now, for this, you should come folding your hands to me." That they they will they tell we will go to Nand Baba and tell and after that if he will be not corrected then we will go to Kans Maharaj and report him he will come with army and arrest you and take you to Mathura but Krishna has nothing to do how <coughs> they obey Krishna what is the meaning? Of this, Krishna is everywhere. When the Jyotan and Dushasan were taking the garment of Draupadi, then Krishna became garment, sari, and then Krishna was wrapped in just Draupadi. So Krishna is everywhere. If you will cover yourself with anyone, even with iron shades or anything, Krishna will, Krishna will must be there. So Krishna saw that their shame for anything should be gone. There should be no any thing. Between us and most beloved gopis, there are so many things that our Goswami has explained. And after that, Krishna told, "Now you are become siddha, and coming sarapur sarapurnima, autumn very soon coming." I will fulfil your desire, and with Nitya Siddha, you will come in my dog, Rashmi Lila Sir, and I will play there with you all. Then, then, after that, Krishna once. He went to border of Mathura and Vrindavan. And there were only a few trees, nothing to eat. Krishna was, Baldev was hungry, not hungry. 
वली टू डू कृपा अवश्य टू यज्ञ पत्नी वाइफ ऑफ ब्राह्मण दोज आर सेक्रीफाइस
they don't got sellers from Vrindavan. So they had heard so much about the beautiful form, wonderful pastimes of Krishna and Balaram. So immediately upon hearing the names of Krishna and Balaram, they were ready to do anything. So the coward boy said, Oh, we are afflicted by the demon of hunger. Please give us some foodstuffs. They immediately got four types of delicious foodstuffs and put them in vessels and immediately were going to leave. Their husbands actually became very uh, astonished at this and they made some injections. But due to the Harikata and the attachment they had in their hearts, hearing this Harikata of Krishna and Balaram from the associates of Krishna and Balaram, they left everything and sur surpassed the obstacle of even their husbands. <clears throat> so then they approached the Ashok a, a Grove along the banks of the Jamuna, and there they saw their beautiful Vishnu Dev's, uh, excuse me, Krishna and Balaram. So there's a very nice verse that I haven't memorized, about the beautiful form of Krishna, the color of Sham, beautiful golden garments. They saw this beautiful form of Krishna with curling black locks of hair. And he was resting his hand on the shoulder of a coward boy, and in one hand he was twirling a lotus. This lotus is compared to be the hearts of Krishna's devotees. So. Krishna smiled at them while they were embracing him with their hearts. They had heard about him, now they were actually embracing Krishna to their hearts. Krishna smiled at them and said, Oh, you are very intelligent because you know the innermost need of the soul to be engaged in the service, my service, with unmotivation, unmotivated desires, and constant endeavor. You have come here now. But then he told them, now you should return back to the performance of Jagya that your husbands are performing and assist them in their duties. The gopis, or excuse me, the Dvichapadis uh, objected to this and said, well, but we have given up everything. We can't go back now because we have neglected their instructions. They surely won't accept us. They may be angered, angry with us. They may even uh, harm us in some way. We can never go back. Krishna assured them and said, Oh, that you, you can go back. They will accept you. And you should be satisfied with this endeavor of yours and go back and help them and maintain association with me in separation. So there's many tickets to deep in this uh, that I won't touch. But it's very important to know that the, the Vichyapatnis did go back and they assisted their husbands in the performances of sacrifice. And <clears throat> they were very satisfied that they had seen Krishna, whom they had heard about and or, uh, had so much deep, intense desire to, to actually embrace within their hearts. So, hearing these pastimes that uh, Gurudev is explaining to us, also within our hearts, we can also develop and transcend just the preliminary, preliminary stages of Shraddha, Shrashta Artha Abhidharana Mayi Shraddha, and enter into hopefully Bhagavat Madhurya Leela Loba Mayi Shraddha by hearing the transcendental pastimes from the lotus lips of such a personality we will hopefully develop the desire of to actually enter into these pastimes led by the most exalted personality before us narrating these pastimes. Why don't you call the Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Krishna. 
with so many personalities of Mahaprasad. They live to their husband, their children, their relatives forever. They did not want to go return back. And Krishna told them, oh, you should return back. And in the end they returned back to their homes. Gopis also, hearing the sweet flute of Krishna, at once they ran to Krishna, giving up children, father, mother, husband, everything, even those who were cooking, they left. If some cooking was done, but it was boiled, even they left. Chapati was burning, left. They were giving milk to children, they left. They left everything and went to Krishna. And Krishna, again, he told them to return back, to be with your husband, children and other things. But gopis argued, they discussed so much with Krishna and defeated Krishna. And Krishna was bound to keep them and to do rock dolls. But Jagya Patni returned, why? Because they are very honorable for Krishna. Jagya Patni, Brahman, with Brahman, ladies, Krishna cannot do rasa or anything. He has so much respect. So he returned by, by Jog Maya, anyhow he returned back. And when they returned back, their husband began to lament, Dhik, Dhik, fight on me, fight on me. All these, our wives, they have no qualification to read Vedas and to do jagya and sacrifice. They have no bhavit, sacred thing. And they went to Krishna and they fulfilled the desire of Krishna and freed this bogus person. We could not. Only for fearing of cancer, but our wife never. Then what became of that Jagya Patni? In this form, Brahmin form, they cannot <coughs> be with Krishna in Rash Lila. But in next birth, because they have desire, so in next, next birth they must be gopis and Krishna will accept them. <coughs> so if anyone like Bharat Maharaj, at the time of death, those who will remember Krishna and his associates, gopis, then he must be like gopis. And Bharat Maharaj, oh, thinking of dear, he became dear. And three births he uh, uh, uh. so <coughs> now Krishna had promised to go peace, Sadhana Siddha, that he will play Rash Lila with them. Krishna ne aap ya aur kya na Kamadama, you should not down and I will be speaking in Hindi because so many ones that I should be speaking in Hindi also. <laughs> because all are speaking in Hindi. Translating. So I should fulfill that also desire those who know him. 
भगवान अभी तारात्रि सर्व और फुल्ल मल लिखा विक्षरण तुम मनस चक्रे जोग माया मुपाशित और कृष्ण सकी इच्छा को पूर्ण करते हैं इसलिए गोपियों को जो ये वरदान दिया था अगले शरद की रात्रियों में मैं तुम्हारे साथ में विहार करूंगा और उसी समय में और सर्द फुल मल्लिका दैट टाइम उस समय में पूर्ण चंद्र था और एक कुक रहा था लाल लाल और उसकी किरणों से मन प्रांत एकदम लाल हो रहा था चंद्रमा को देखा और स्मरण किया कि चंद्रमा हमें कुछ कह रहे हैं क्या कह रहे हैं देखो मैंने बृहस्पति के स्त्री को चुरा लाया और उनके साथ अपना घर बसाया तो तुम भी स्मरण करो हमारे वंश में हो इसलिए इन गोपियों के साथ में विहार करो रास इत्यादि करो असल में रास का माने है क्या रस से रास होता है रस क्या चीनी का शरबत नहीं अम्बट है रस वो भी नहीं कृष्ण कथाओं का जो रस है कृष्ण को सुंदर कृष्ण को देखने से हृदय में जो रस होता है आनंद होता है वो रस है जब कृष्ण को धन्य करने के लिए गोपियां नित्य और गान के साथ में उनके साथ में नृत्य इत्यादि करती हैं तब उसको रास करते हैं जैसे कि कृष्ण प्रसन्न होते हैं कृष्ण ने वो चीज स्मरण करके हाँ तो उस समय क्या हो रहा था सर्व उत्फुल्ल बल दिखा सब काल में नदियों का जल एकदम निर्मल हो गया आकाश भी निर्मल था उसमें चंद्र भी लाल लाल भी पूरब दिशा में कूद रहे हैं उस समय में वृंदावन के कुंज सजे हुए हैं उन कुंजों में तरह तरह की सामग्रिया हैं इस तरह से विश्वा कुमुदमंत अखंड मंडलम रमान लाभम नवकुम कुमार बनंत तक को मद गोपी रंजितम जब वो कलम बाम दिशा मन हो रहा है इसलिए चोग माया के द्वारा गोपियों को आकर्षित किया है और उस समय में अपने बंसी पर क्लिंग जो शब्द है जिसमें कृष्ण की सारी लीलाएं हैं सब कुछ है जो मोक्षना इत्यादि स्वरों से संबंधित है हरा हुआ है वो बंसी बजाया या बंसी त्रिलोक को भेद कर ब्रह्मांड को भेद कर ब्रह्मलोक इत्यादि को वैकुंठ को भेद करके गोलोक वृंदावन में माताओं को भी छोड़ दिया माताओं नहीं सुन पाई नहीं तो वो दौड़ी आती नहीं सुन पाई देवियां स्वर्ग की भी नहीं सुन पाई वो केवल गोपियों के कानों में गया और गोपियों ने सुना निशम गीतम तथा नंग वर्धनम बजस्ती और कृष्ण गिरी तमाम गोपियों के कान में गया और उनके कानों से हृदय में गया और उनके हृदय को मन को चुरा दिया निकल करके भागा और कहा गया जहां कृष्ण थे और कृष्ण को वो मन दे दिया गोपियां तड़फड़ा उठी हमारे हृदय के धन को मन को ही चुरा कर करके लेकर के भागा जा रहा है अतः वो भी पीछे पीछे दौड़ी उस समय उनके भाई बंधु इत्यादि जो जहां थे वहीं पर रह गए 
और किसी ने किसी गोपी को नहीं कहा ये चलो बंसी पर अलक्षित मंत्री आप दूसरे के अलक्षित हो वो समझ जाए मैं ही जा रही हूं वो समझ जाए मैं ही कोटि कोटि गोपियां वहां पर पहुंची कृष्ण के पास में पहुंचे किस लिए कृष्ण ने कहा कि लौट जाओ तो उन्होंने कहा हमारा दे दो हृदय संपत्ति मन है हमारी संपत्ति मन के बिना जाएंगी कहा हम मन ही रहेगा तो पैर भी नहीं चलते हम लोग नहीं जा सकते इस प्रकार से आज अन्यो अन्न अलक्षित सब यत्र कान तो जब अलोल कुंडल कान में कुंडल छप छलक रहे हैं इस तरह से कृष्ण के तरफ में आए नाउ हु विल ट्रांसलेट Actually, only Sri Krishna can fulfill the desires of all. Therefore, we heard how Krishna gave benedictions to those southern city gopis that soon we will meet and give ras. Therefore, in the autumn month, Sarat Purnima, Krishna saw the full moon. At that time, the rays of the setting sun were reddish, and they made the full moon red. At that time, Chandra was the full moon was indicating to Krishna. Before, I also stole the wife of the guru of the demigods, Brihaspati. Therefore, you are in my dynasty. You should also do the same with the wives of the gopas. Therefore, from ras comes ras. What is ras? Is it a sherbet drink? No. It is. We cannot even say it is nectar. But actually, ras is that feeling of happiness or ecstasy that the gopis feel when they see the face of Krishna. When that combines with mixing with Krishna, talking with Him, singing and dancing, that astonishing taste becomes a substance called ras. Therefore, Krishna, when He saw the full moon, He remembered all of this. At that time was Sarad or autumn. Therefore, the sky was clear, the rivers were clear, the moon was full. All the favorable ingredients for the performance of ras were. We were ready there. The kunjas were beautifully decorated. Everything was perfect for the performance of Krishna's pastimes. Therefore, understanding his desire, Yogamaya attracted the gopis, and by his flute he blew the sound clean. In this sound, all the leelas of Krishna, everything is there. This sound from the flute of Krishna crossed the three worlds, even through past the planet of Lord Brahma. Path into Goloka Vrindavan, and only into the ears of the gopis. No mothers like Madhya Sarov could hear that; otherwise, there would be a disturbance in the pastimes. Even the ladies from the heavenly planets could not catch that sound. That sound went only into the ear of the gopis. From the ear, that sound went into their hearts and stole their minds. Then that flute sound returned to Krishna. And surrendered the minds of the gopis back to the go to Krishna. Then the gopis, in order to recover their minds and hearts, they ran to where Krishna was situated to recover their minds. At that time, in a hidden way, the gopi, the flute called each gopi that, in a way that was unknown to the other gopis. Therefore, millions and millions of gopis returned there to where Krishna was present. Krishna said, "Why have you come? You should return home." Don't you know that I am the presiding deity? I am the owner of all hearts and minds. Therefore, the Gopi said, "How we can return without our hearts? Without our minds, even our feet cannot move." जिस समय कृष्ण के बंसी को सुना घर से, उस समय गोपियां जो गाय का दूध दो रही थी अपने और जो बच्चनों को पकड़ रही थी उसके पति दूह रहे थे उसको छोड़ दिया बस साथ ही साथ में 
चल पड़े बड़ी उत्सुक उत्कंठित होकर के और कोई दूध को गर्म कर रही थी और उतार रही थी दधी बनाने के लिए वो उसको चूल्हे पर ही छोड़ दिया और कोई दलिया बना रही थी दलिया को चूल्हे पर छोड़ दिया झान न मैं जाओ कृष्ण के पास में चली कोई अपने पति को बच्चों को परवेशन कर रही थी प्रसाद दे रही थी सुना और बस छोड़ दिया चल पड़ी कोई अपने बच्चों को उनके बच्चे नहीं थे उनके भाइयों की स्त्रियों की जो बच्चे थे उनको पिला रही थी शंबर से उनको दूध पिला रही थी वो भी छोड़ दिया कोई पति की शुश्रूषा कर रही थी स्नान करा रही थी या और कोई काम कर रही थी बस उसी समय में पति को छोड़ दिया चल पड़ी और कोई आंख में आजन लगा रही थी एक आंख में लगाया दूसरी में बाकी था और छोड़ दिया भूल गई अंजन लगाना थी कोई घर की पोत रही थी वो भी छोड़ दिया कोई वस्त्र पहन रही थी कोई आभूषण पहन रही थी तो वस्त्र को किसी प्रकार से इधर का उधर पहन लिया आभूषण को जो गले का है वो पैर में लगा लिया जो यहां का गले का हार है उसको पहले भी जैसे पैर में पहन लिया सब अलंकारों को इधर का उधर पहन लिए जब कृष्ण के पास पहुंचेंगी ना आज नौ नामों के ग्राम है आज नौ अंजन से आज नौ कृष्ण देखा रही तुमने एक ही आंख में आंजन लगाया बस लेकर के अपने आंखों से अपने हाथों से अंजन लगाया अरे ये अलंकार सब उल्टा पुलटा पाने उनका अलंकार भी ठीक किया तो उसी अवस्था में कृष्ण के पास चले गए तब वर्जमा अनापति भी वे पतियों के द्वारा मना करने पर भी लाख मना किया मत जाओ मत जाओ अंधेरी रात है कहा जाए मत जाओ मना किया किंतु मानी नहीं यहां पर यह विचार करने की बात है ये गोपियां चार प्रकार की होती हैं एक नित्य सिद्धा कृष्ण के नित्य परिकर लादनी शक्ति और उसके प्रकार राधा जी ललिता विशाखा चंद्रा भद्रा श्यामला ये सब जो सखियां हैं वो नित्य सिद्धि है उनको कोई रोक नहीं सकता वो तो चली रही सिद्ध है जो देवताओं के अंश से आई हैं और जो मुनिचरी ऋषिचरी है दंडकारण्य की जो स्त्री आती अयोध्या वहां